At 10 tonight, we have new details on a congressman caught with a pistol inside a North Carolina airport. This happened back in February at the Asheville Regional Airport, and it all became public over the weekend after a political group looking to oust Representative Madison Cawthorn posted the incident online. Here's Fox 46 Chief Investigator Jody Barr. Madison Cawthorn. Just six weeks after this appearance in D.C., Madison Cawthorn got into a security checkpoint line at the Asheville Regional Airport and dropped his luggage at the scanner. Inside, TSA agents found a loaded 9mm pistol, just like this one, inside the congressman's bag. 14, just be advised, it's going to be an elected official, Madison Cawthorn's firearm. An elected official? Yes. House of Representatives elected official? Not to that, it doesn't make a difference. You still got to get the information. They've got to have the proper channels to, to carry it through. Cawthorn isn't the first person caught doing this in Asheville this year. Since January, Asheville Airport Police caught eight people with a gun inside a TSA checkpoint. Fines for carrying a loaded gun through TSA security range from $3,000 to $10,000. Airport police did not charge Cawthorn. Instead, helped the first-term congressman make his flight. Communications. We're going to step out to the vehicle, let him stow the weapon, and then try to get him back. Uh, try to get him back to security for his flight. Uh, their flight leaves in seven minutes. I'm, what I'm thinking is we're just going to keep the fire on, and uh, he can, uh, re uh, you know, he can take it back. Uh, when he comes back through. Airport police eventually ended up storing the congressman's gun until he flew back into town to pick it up one week later. Cawthorn's office says it was an accident, writing in a statement that the congressman erroneously stowed a firearm in his carry-on that often doubles as a range bag instead of his check bag. The firearm was secured and unchambered. I asked the TSA whether Cawthorn at least faces fines, but the TSA would not confirm any details about the congressman. The government did confirm it's referred Cawthorn's case to civil enforcement, but the TSA would not discuss the status of that enforcement action. Cawthorn's office also would not confirm whether the TSA fined the congressman or if he's facing any penalties over taking the gun into the airport. Jody Barr, Fox 46 Investigates.